どうしたんだ Well, everything is connected. And by the end of this video, I promise you that Lollipop will die like Yukari. I'm using a development edition, and there are bugs that I couldn't avoid. But nevertheless, it is a very impressive work. So I decided to upload it anyway. Let's begin. In my music folder, I only have two albums, and I specifically care to sync the K on. Additionally, the album is on FLAC format. So I want to convert it to MP3, to save some space. I have only set music folder as source on preferences, so Lollipop will load those two albums. Speaking of which, I'm wondering when GNOME Music is going to do that, or even GNOME Photos. Next I will connect my phone, and then we will get a new option here. For syncing stuff. There we go. A new lollipop over debuts. Before I start syncing, I will open my phone music storage, so I can have some live coverage on what's happening. That's basically empty. Because I'm only listening to YouTube. But anyway, it is convenient for the demo purposes. Back to Lollipop, we now have a new option to add albums or playlists on sync with our phone. A really nice feature is that we can press these buttons and only see the stuff we are syncing. For example, it will only display K on, because that's the only thing I sync. Now, I want to convert FLAC files to MP3, but that will crash it. So instead, I will not do any decoding, and hopefully Lollipop will just move the FLACs from PC to phone. 